And a Republican from Michigan is speaking out after not qualifying for the debate. We're talking about Perry Johnson. He's furious with the RNC tonight. He talked with Fox 2's Charlie Langton. You call the RNC a corrupt organization? Actually, it's bizarre. The RNC is the Republican National Committee, and Perry Johnson thought he qualified to be on Wednesday's presidential debate stage, but they said no. There is no way we're just going to let the RNC get away with their corrupt procedures. Eight Republican presidential candidates will debate Wednesday night in Milwaukee because they met the criteria of polling at least 1% and having at least 40,000 unique contributions. Johnson, known as the quality guru when he ran for governor of Michigan, has the contributions, but it's the acceptable polling that's the problem. They said your polling wasn't national, some of them, like uh, like Victory Insight, and they, they cited specific polls. You disagree? 100%. Let's face it. Nobody in Washington wants to be there. Who would want an efficiency expert in Washington? <laughs> Are you going to sue the RNC? Of course. Even though Johnson is polling close to 1%, he's in line with many other Republicans, other than Donald Trump. But what does it say about the fact that he's being charged in multiple states, multiple felonies? Uh, I think people would have paid a lot more attention to it if there had not been... All you, think this corruption merit, you think there's before. merit in those Trump charges? I have not gone in to even delve into the But you Trump know charges. a little bit about it, though. Uh, a little bit, yeah. But, you know, the, the problem is the media hype, hypes everything up to such an extent. You think this is a planned media attention by Trump? Well, I know that Trump takes advantage of the media. What did Trump say? No media is bad media. Is he right? He may be right. <laughs> Every time he gets an indictment, his polls go up. I need an indictment. You need an indictment. If I had an indictment, believe me, my poll numbers would be well over 3%. We reached out to the RNC for comment, but nothing yet. Also, no word on what the judge will do with this lawsuit. In Bloomfield Hills, Charlie Langton, Fox 2 News.